Margarita jumped with joy. My human doggy, she cried. I want to see it and play with it. Bring it immediately to my bedroom. Donna de Ulla coughed politely. Margarita looked at her for a moment in astonishment. Then she got it. Already on the day of the race, Zahir had been feeling sick. Seeing that he was unusually skittish, his trainer had decided to have him wear a racing hood, a black openwork cover strapped over his head like an iron mask with holes for his ears, plastic blinder cups blocking his view from the sides. Zahir, black, powerful, febrile, shying more and more, kicking, dancing in place on the track, his impetuous hooves pounding the ground. It had started with a chance meeting in a bar in Vesterbro. He was way out of her league, she thought, when she spotted him by the window to the courtyard, where he stood with his arms folded, feet at ten to two, with a very straight back and a cigarette in a clenched fist. His t-shirt was rather tight, but it was probably hard to resist the temptation to dress like that when you had a great body. Welcome to the Sugar Club. Welcome to Word on Street for the Alliance Française Reading. We are really delighted to be part of the event organized by Dublin UNESCO City of Literature and European Institute and Embassy. I'm very happy to welcome and to thank Rosaline Linehan who has accepted to do the reading for us tonight. You have the right. You're a liar. You're a cheat. You do whatever suits you. Yes, I have the right to protect myself from you. I don't get the truth from you, so I have to find it myself. You take this woman to a romantic hotel and share a room and a bed with her and you take me for a fool. First, you think I'm too dumb to see through your lies. Now you think I'm so dumb, I'll let myself be talked out of the truth. I woke up dripping with sweat. I thought I could spot mice and lizards crawling up the walls of my room. Now I realise there aren't any, but a minute ago I could have sworn there were. Michelle is there staring at me. The picture in the poster behind him isn't clear. At first I think, where, where am I? My roommate asks me, are you done yelling? Haven't I got the right to sleep at night? I look at him without saying a word. Misha, Giuseppe Maria Mifsud as Valletta, Mach Paula aga Salvu, Prola Tarach aga Sochili Jungwilche. Beside the homeless person's head, Rick's face appeared. My brother's son grinned at the camera. Take one, he said, action! Then with no warning, he struck the man on the side of his head with the palm of his hand on the ear. It was a real rabbit punch. The head lurched to the side. It's my great pleasure to welcome you at the European Literature Night. After a golden period of prosperity on the Kiev stock market, Lala's grandfather went bankrupt for the first time. Brought up in a solemn belief in steam and electricity, the natural sequence of events and the logic of cause and effect, he must have felt cheated. Welcome to this um, episode of Words on the Street. And it's great to see people walking around the streets with the, with, with the programmes in their hand, and I hope you're, you're enjoying it. All I liked about chemistry was the acids I used to splash on the girls' skirts. <laughs> they didn't find it funny. The age when they gave you a bonus after you'd spent X number of years with the company, when you went out for lunch at midday and didn't come back. You could have a leisurely cup of coffee in the morning, snooze through the afternoon and when September came round there would be an individual study grant to cover all the kids needs. In the Buckley home, Mr and Mrs Buckley sat at their kitchen table and watched as officers carried items of Ritz clothing from the house. Mr Buckley put his head in his hands. Mrs Buckley didn't hide her tears. They ran freely down her face and fell to her table from her chin. Mm -hmm. 